guys, welcome back. So today I am just finishing up packing. I actually leave for the Disney College program tomorrow. Oh, can you believe it? I feel like the time has passed by so fast. I feel like I just was getting my acceptance letter yesterday and it was September and now here it is January and I'm getting ready to leave. So it's so crazy. I'm pretty much all the way packed. I just have a few things left that I just need to make sure that I have ready and then I think I'm good to go. So I have everything ready and packed and then also I do have a little bandage on my chin right here. Um, it's kind of, if you're like far away you can't really tell but because um, it's skin colored. I went to the doctor this morning and I actually have been to the dermatologist a few times over the years just because I do have a family history of skin cancer and I'm just very light complected. I burn really easy in the sun and I just like to go and get my skin looked at like every once in a while make sure everything's okay. And I had a mole right here on my chin. The doctor went ahead and removed it this morning so that's why I have a little bandage right there. It wasn't cancerous or anything like that. But I will have this little bandage on my chin for the next couple of days but I mean like I said kind of far away like I don't think it's too noticeable or anything so I don't really mind but I mean it kind of sucks that like I'm leaving for the program and I have this little like band-aid on my chin and everything is like trying to heal up and stuff so yeah I mean other than that I'm just like getting everything ready um, I just have a couple last minute things that I have to do like I printed out my boarding pass for check-in already but for some reason I have lost it I don't know where it's at like I lose so many things, it's crazy. I just am always losing something. Like, I lose my phone on basically a daily basis. So I lost that, so I need to print out another one of those. And then I also need to grab my passport, just make sure I have, like, everything ready for check-in. And other than that, I have everything, like, all ready to go. I'll show you guys my, like, little stockpile here in a second of everything that I'm taking. But my parents are coming over later today to pick up my stuff, get the car all packed up tonight. That way, tomorrow morning, we are ready to go. So, yeah, I am driving with my parents. I won't have a car at the program, which really sucks because I was hoping that I would. But I'm having, like, a whole bunch of car issues. I got into a car accident and just like a whole bunch of crazy stuff happened. So I won't be having a car at the college program, but I'm not that worried about it since there is a bus system there. Um, and I'm sure it won't be a big deal. So yeah, I'm riding with my parents down to the program. We're leaving tomorrow morning. I'm really excited. It's going to be me, my mom, my dad, and my sister. And my sister actually is going to miss a couple days of school for the trip. Actually, I check in Monday and her birthday is on Tuesday. She's turning 12. So happy birthday, Brooklyn. She was like really, really sad that I wasn't going to be here for her birthday. So my mom decided to turn the weekend into like a little trip. And we're going to spend the weekend at Disney. We are going to get tickets and go to the park parks and stuff um, before I check in so it'll be just like a weekend with my family to celebrate the college program and then also my sister's birthday we have reservations at Crystal Palace because that is her favorite place to eat in Magic Kingdom and my mom also loves Winnie the Pooh so like we always eat at Crystal Palace when we go so I'm really excited for that and you guys will also be seeing videos of me traveling down to Florida and then celebrating this weekend with my family spending the weekend at Disney and then I check in Monday so I am super excited to share all of that with you guys. But first, let me show you everything that I have packed up so far. This is everything. I have everything ready to go here. My cat is in the front, just being cute. So I will show you everything that I have. I think this is everything that I'm going to bring with me. Okay, so starting at the back over here, I have my mattress topper that I am going to be putting on the bed. And then in this bag, I have this blanket that I have been working on crocheting. It's getting pretty big now. I'll show you guys when it's finished. It's almost done. And then I just have some hangers in there as well. And then this stuff right here, I have just this basket. I'll probably put this in like the top of my closet or something like that and put things in it. But right now it has just kind of miscellaneous stuff that I'm bringing with me. So it has a picture of me and Caleb. And then I just have some like bathroom um, organizer storage things. I just figured that it would be easiest to keep everything where it's at and just put these inside of this little basket here. That way I can just take them out when I get there and put them right into the bathroom. And then underneath that, I have these little storage containers. I got them at Ikea. They're really cute. I'll probably keep these in the bathroom as well. Um, this bottom one just has like my hair dryer, my hair straightener, and hair stuff in that. These top two have like medicine, like little first aid kit stuff, and like I think lotion, just like random girl stuff. And I really like these because they're stackable. So again, I can just put these right into like the bathroom drawer 
It'll be so easy to store everything. So I'm really happy that I got those. And then my backpack right here has all of my shoes in it. I did not have anything else to put my shoes in. So all my shoes are in this backpack here. And then these duffel bags on the front. If you can't tell, like, I love your Bradley, okay? Don't judge. And this big duffel bag right here has all my clothes in it. All my clothes fit in there. I was hoping my shoes would fit as well, but it didn't. And this thing, let me tell you, it is so heavy. And then I have this small duffel bag right here. This one, I actually have like three or four changes of clothes in it. And then I'm gonna put this toiletry bag in it as well. I'm just planning on using this bag as my travel bag. That way I'm not having to dig clothes out of this big duffel bag here. We're leaving on Thursday and I check in on Monday. So I have a few different changes of clothes in here and I just thought it would be a lot simpler. So I'm just gonna put that one in the car, not worry about it until Monday, and then I have this little bag that I'm going to be using while we are traveling and then while we are staying at the hotel this weekend until I check in. And then this is just my toiletry bag. I'm just gonna put that right in there. It still has a little bit of room left in it. Um, and then this little backpack here, um, it's like a little mini backpack, but I am planning on just keeping this in the car with me. This backpack is going to have like my camera, my phone charger. Oh, hi kitty. Okay, so this one is just going to have my camera, phone charger, headphones, um, just stuff I want to keep in the car with me. And then I also am planning on taking this to the parks with me because it's a really small, cute backpack. And I think it'll work great for taking to the parks. And then I just have my MacBook here in the case. And then I also have this tripod that I'm bringing with me as well. And then I think that is pretty much everything. The only thing that is not here that I'm bringing with me is a laundry basket that just has like a couple blankets and my sheets in it. And that is already at my mom's house. And then I have a couple of decorations. Like I have a little wastebasket for the bedroom and a desk calendar that I got at Target. And those things are already with my mom as well. So this is the majority of what I am bringing. So hopefully all of this fits in the car. I'll let you guys know how it goes. Okay, so everything made it in the trunk, just barely. Everything's like shoved in there, packed full. But we got it all in, so good job, Heather. Good job, Mom. And we are ready to go. Okay, so it's the next day and everything is all packed up. It barely fit in the trunk and we are officially on our way to Disney World. We're just getting started. It's gonna be a little bit over a 16 hour drive and I'm really excited. Are you excited? Yes, we're ready to go ride some rides. Yeah, so we're ready to go to Disney World and we will see you guys in the next video. Bye. Bye.